You've got TMAU questions, and I've got your answers. This is The Gut War. So I had a subscriber recently ask me, what is the gut war? And to help you understand better, I drew a diagram for you explaining how you can cure TMAU2 through your gut and win the war. <coughs> so I drew this diagram and you've got the bad guys over here, you've got the good guys over here, and then you've got TMA here with these bacteria eating the TMA with the whole gut war. So, the first bad guy is antibiotics. Antibiotics will kill everything in your gut, including the good guys. And when things start growing again, sometimes the bad guys grow faster than the good guys, causing a surplus of TMA. TMA is not good. Why is TMA not good? Because TMA, a surplus causes a fishy odor, a fecal odor, garbage, sewage, smoke, burning rubber. Uh, a lot of different smells can emit from that and, and uh, ammonia-like odor at higher concentrations. So TMA is the enemy. That's what makes you smell. Um, so how can we solve that? Let's go over to the good guys. So when the good guys are dead, obviously there's going to be a surplus of TMA. But when you have good guys like, like specifically lactobacillus, thermophilus, and B. longum, these certain strands of uh, probiotics can metabolize and use the TMA uh, nitrous buildup as uh, nutrition to feed these guys, so it doesn't come out of your so it doesn't come out of your skin with vapors, your breath, your urine. Uh, whenever there's a surplus, it just comes out of you, and you start smelling. So we want to focus on winning the gut war, and that's how you win. TMAU. So yeah, these three eat the TMA buildup. What can you do? How, how can you how can you get these guys in your gut? Well, there's kefir. Kefir's amazing because it establishes new colonies inside of your gut. Kefir's the strongest probiotic that I have found. I, I take all organic and food-based probiotics. Let food be thy medicine, and medicine be thy food, is what uh, a wise man said in philosophy. Uh, kombucha, getting a lot of good news about kombucha. I do not think it's better than kefir. Kefir has the ability to establish new colonies. From what I understand, kombucha is excellent at uh, decomposing TMA, but not establishing new colonies, from what I understand. Fermented foods. Learn to love fermented foods like pickles in the cold section. Make sure you buy them in the cold section. Uh, kimchi, sauerkraut. Your goal... Ugh. All right, all right, all right. Your goal is to establish colonies of good gut bacteria. That's your goal. So that once your gut is cured, there will be no more smells. You're going to be extremely happy and uh, focus on winning the gut war. That is your, that is your new uh, goal in life if you have TMAU. Other than that, I hope this video was useful. I know it was. And have a great day. Oh, subscribe, like the video, share it. Uh, TMAU is a very confusing subject and I feel like I have the information needed to clear this all up and I want to break the shackles of TMAU off of a lot of sufferers and uh, what else? I guess, uh, oh, the Discord. There's a Discord in the uh, description. Go to that Discord. There's a community of TMAU sufferers that are curing themselves. Anyway, you have a good day.